Hello and welcome back. I'm David Taylor and this is another news episode. Many of you have enjoyed the sales data industry analysis that I did a couple of weeks ago. And today we're going to be looking at hybrids, new energy vehicles, electric car sales in South Africa. Let's go. What's the car with cars.coza? Bow down to the radio. Her car is the most luxurious lady you'll see today. After her, of course. Now, think of a car. Any car. Yes, we have it. Cars.coza. Let's find what moves you. Right, so the data we have is from NAMSA, and that stands for National Automobile Manufacturers Association of SA. They're pretty important. And this data period accounts for the first half of 2024. And we're going to be looking at new energy vehicles, which is your hybrids, plug-in hybrids, and electric cars. Now, if you're a frequent user of our content, you'll know that there's always a lot of chatter about hybrids, electric cars, new energy vehicles, locally and internationally. But in this video, I'm going to unpack the sales numbers. I mean, who's actually putting their money where their mouth is? Who is buying a greener car? Admittedly, there aren't that many plug-in hybrids available, and they're actually less popular than pure electric battery vehicles. But vehicles in this segment, I mean, there's a handful of Volvos, XC60, XC90 are PHEVs. There's a handful of Porsches, a couple of big BMW SUVs, Lexus NX, RX, both have a PHEV in their derivatives. And of course, there's the Toyota RAV4 Prime which we reviewed and we'll link to that. Really good car though. In total, there are 298 PHEVs sold. But interestingly, in comparison to last year's figure of 336, it looks like this segment is growing nicely. I mean, at the end of the year, we'll do a huge data crunch and we'll see exactly who's buying what. But which model is the most popular? Now, officially BMW doesn't really supply all its sales figures locally on the regular. But we have it on very good authority that it's the BMW X1 xDrive 30e. That was SA's most popular PHEV for the first half of 2024. As a reminder, the BMW X1 is a well-lauded car. I mean, it took two categories in our Cars Awards. So now this third model is the popular PHEV. I mean, the awards just keep on coming. So a little slow clap to the Bavarian car maker. Traditional hybrids are next. These are your self-charging vehicles. I mean, the principle is really straightforward. You accelerate gently, there's electric assist, you come off the gas, and the thing starts charging. Um, also, when you're coming down a hill, you can ease off the accelerator and the battery will recoup. It's a very clever system, and there's one brand that just runs rampant with this tech, and that, of course, is Toyota. Right now, these are the bulk share of the new energy vehicles. 86% of the entire new energy market is self-charging hybrids. So which model is doing all the damage? It's the Corolla Cross Hybrid. The numbers are impressive with 203% growth year on year. 6,100 traditional hybrids were sold in the first half of 2024. So I think massive round of applause to Toyota for just absolutely killing it here. Finally, onto the electric cars. I mean, you either love them, you hate them, it's still controversial. Me, I like the idea of a little electric car just to tootle around town and then you have your petrol or diesel big family car for the adventuring. I would love the prices to come down though. Jeez, I mean, that's ridiculous. So in the first half of 2024, 749 EVs were sold. That's January to middle of the year. But interestingly, in comparison to last year's sales figures, NAMSA said 929 electric cars were sold in South Africa. So it looks like 2024 is going to be an electric car record which is a nice thing to have. I mean, that's progress, isn't it? Naturally, you're probably curious going, which brand is doing all the work here? And it's Volvo doing the heavy lifting. It's the Volvo EX30. They sold 281 units. Now that's one in three electric cars sold in South Africa is a Volvo EX30. Now, Volvo EX30, I think it's a pretty amazing car. I think there's a couple of software glitches they still need to iron out. I get a little feeling that the product was a bit rushed. But at that price for the performance and the value, that is a really, really cool car. As a reminder, there are other brands playing in the electric car space. Volvo, again, has the XC40 Recharge. It's such a superb car. It's one of my favorites. They also have the C40 Recharge. But if you want something else, Jaguar, BMW, GWM, Mini, Audi, Merc, Porsche, Lotus, they all have battery electric vehicles for you to choose from. We've driven most of these and we'll link the content in the description below. There's been some impressive growth. 18 brands offering new energy vehicles and there's more brands coming to South Africa. We can't say too much now, but we'll, we'll talk about those brands when they touch down before the end of the year. In total, based on supply data and our great maths, 7,164 new energy vehicles were sold in the first half of 2024. But in comparison to the entire new car market over the same period, 
new energy is just 3% of total sales. So there's still some way to go before they're making serious inroads. That wraps up today's video. I hope you've enjoyed the snapshot and insights into the South African car buying mindset. I mean, new energy vehicles still got a way to go before they're making really serious numbers, but small steps, we'll get there eventually. But as always, we'll link all the content and links in the description below. And if you decide, you know what, now's a good time. I'm, I'd like to buy a new energy vehicle. Well, head on over to Casa Cosa. We have an app, we have a mobile site, we have a desktop site. We have 75,000 vehicles for sale. Let's find what moves you. Okay, bye. What's the car with cars.coza? Bow down to the radio. Her car is the most luxurious lady you'll see today. After her, of course. Now, think of a car, any car. Yes, we have it. Cars.coza. Let's find what moves you.